Hello and welcome to Let's Play Unreal World RPG. I forgot what I was playing there. Um, this is Valen, and this is a new Let's Play. And it's something that is at space. No, it's surprising. I'm clearing stuff off so I can get to my laptop. So I can access the internet in all of its glory. Um, this game was recommended to me by Kentucky. And through a Let's Play that he um, gave me the URL to, which I should link below if I remember. I may not. Um, I kind of had a foobarb last night. I tried to record, and apparently... I had the microphone plugged in wrong. So... Ah. Damn, that's loud. Saved game here, and since it's a roguelike game, I can't really do much. Empathy. How loud? Let me just go down more. I also have a bit of a headache, so... And some... Uh, Uh, allergies affecting me. So, may not be completely on my game. Um, hey, stop that, you're moving the table. I'm talking to my dog. There we go. There's the wiki. Didn't know that there was mods for this game. Okay. Here we go. This is what I wanted. Um. Is it this one? Yeah, character creation. Camo. Kimu? Hmm. Knife of hunting bow, arrow cord. Hmm. Yeah, I've managed to get kind of far, but not really far. Um. Where are the. That, there's the cultures, that's what I want to look at. Okay. I'm gonna start out. Most likely as a northern culture, I started out as the Seal Tribe, because they have the ability to start out with um, a hand axe, which is very, which would be very useful. But I want to start out with somebody who can have a fishing rod. Fishing is very, very useful. And they have, yeah, starting skill bonuses, ritual, weather lord, dodge, and fishing. Fishing, weather lore, swimming, dagger. Mm -hmm. Yeah. Two to four weapons. Wow. It's quite a bit of few. That's quite a few weapons. Um. I really want to start out with some sort of axe to make uh, felling trees easier for me. Hmm. See, see, they have a really high fishing, but I'd be pressed to get a fishing rod to use that to my advantage. And they start out with no trapping, no swimming, and no sword. Which really isn't that big of a divot, but they don't have very good skills. This is kind of hard for me to sh get a good uh, seal character uh, roll up. I know you guys are just looking at a screen. I'm looking at uh, my... I probably should have done this before I started recording. Um... I'm gonna try to get a decent seal character if I can't. Um, ah. so loud for me, I don't. Hopefully
hopefully that's not that loud for you guys. I will call this one Valen again. It won't let me. Okay, well this will be Valen Jr. Um, let's try Valen. Actually, you know what? This is my real name. I will never put my last name for uh, personal reasons on YouTube, but that's my real name. My real name is Brendan. And Valis is another one of the uh, handles I go by on the internet. Um, uh, Eastern Peoples. Uh, let's just go back. Um, uh, see, Owl Tribe has the highest survival skill out of any start. But the, it doesn't say what you, um, like your possible starting equipment. But you have a high survival, high climbing, high dodge, and club. An Oath of Iron is pretty damn useful. Uh, the Let's Play I watched, he started as that. But see, I don't want to start as the same person, or as the same thing. So that's why I wanted to do like a seal village, or, or something else. Hmm. I think I'll try to do seal, because they have the highest intelligence, the highest agility, and the highest speed. They're only the third worst. Or fourth, their fourth ranking on the ranks. It's Al, Camus, and Kelto. Probably pronounced all those wrong. Oh, and I'm up to 40 subs. So, good job, people. Oh, I already kind of decided on what the portrait I will have. And this just kind of determines difficulty of how hard it's going to be for me to start. Winter's very hard. Spring is the easiest start, I think. Um, that's actually a good phobia. That's very low intelligence. See, that's something I didn't get. I could, you know, they're supposed to have the highest intelligence, but that's a very low intelligence. It took me forever to get a decent intelligence. Ooh, oh, but that's a terrible pho phobia. Mm. Fear of open spaces. Fear of people in crowds. That's decent. Uh, see, I'm very afraid that if I... Ooh, but damn, that's all bad. I'm gonna try... This guy's kind of big. I kind of like this though, but my senses aren't very good. He has quite a few bit of endurance. Dexterity is very high, so is agility. Eyesight is great. Intelligence is pretty good. Strength is very good. That's actually, I think, the best strength roll I've gotten. Um. Yeah, I'm going to go with this character, or this role. Um, oh, Oath of Iron, ooh. Blood Stunching Prayer, yeah, that's healing, but I'm going to go with Oath of Iron. See, I had trouble with this. Okay, we're just going to, that's looked it. Um, see, my climbing sucks ass. So does my bow. My bow's actually not bad. My crossbow's great. But, try finding a crossbow. What's my spear? My spear is terrible. I think I'm gonna put in spear so my spear and bow are the same poopy level. Um, climbing, because that's important. 
carpentry. Yeah, carpentry. Survival's not bad, but that's always a good skill to have. Weather lore is really high. Foraging, hide working, tracking. Hmm. Yep, that's what I'm going with. Because this this game's kinda touchy about that. So um This isn't terrible. I actually kind of like this world. Um, where's my start location, though? Um, getting really close to the screen. See if I oh, I saw it move there. Oh, wow, that's too far south. I don't want to. I see the farther south you start, the better off I'd ha I'm gonna have it. That would actually be a decent start location. I don't really want to know exactly where I start. So... Um... You know what I'm gonna do? That guy I saw did, and I can't remember his name, and I'm not sub to him, so I can't... So I don't necessarily know how to find him. Should we have an idea? I think this is it. Yeah. Um. M. L. Belk is his name. Yeah, that's the person I saw. Um. Okay. Yeah, I'm kind of going to do what he did and close my eyes and hit R like five times. And then start. One, two, oh, yeah, one, two, three, four, five. And I will not check the video to find out where I started. Um, I'm tempted to do this whole abandoned camp thing. Um, that would be nice because I get some stuff. Two unfinished cottages. Yeah. I did this last time. I might do village. Um, for years. Hmm. I think I will do the abandoned camp. Um, as you are wandering through the wilderness, you find a camp. As you explore, you saw that there was a perfectly usable shelter for a rainy night, some already chopped firewood, and a few interesting items. This would be a good place for you to spend some time and make it and make journeys and hunting trips. What you brought here and what kind of your past and what kind of past your past is like is a matter of your imagination. You at you are at a camp where you where damn I can't speak. At a camp where to ponder about the path to take. You can take items lying around as a hint, or you can make a fire and throw them into it one by one. As always, everything is up to you. I think I'm gonna kind of do this scenario and say like my guy has amnesia, and this is um 
his camp. So yeah, um, I'm gonna do the Unreal World, even though I should do Living in the Wild. Living in the Wild. Um, I kind of know how to play better now than last time. I know what my mistake is. Um, so yeah. Okay. Around me. Ooh, an iron great helm. Definitely, oh. A shirt, short, male, hambrick. Oh, wow, that's a uh, heavy. Uh -uh. Nice little shelter. A log. Dirty firewood. A slender tree trunk. actually really nice. Let's check my inventory to see what I started out with. Yes, a hand axe, but no weapons to speak of. Oh, wow, that sucks. That, that totally sucks. I'm glad there's a... I'm glad I got some nice stuff. Closed iron helm, covering the skull, face, and neck. I got a... I have a fur cloak, a nether cloak. Wow. A nettle cloak, I mean... Linen trousers and fur footwear. Okay, you can tell that this was made by somebody from Britain. Because they said trousers, not pants. That's actually some fun trivia that I remember from um, my world history class. What I called my political correctness class. It, um, they said that uh, the English call your pants, as Americans call them, trousers. And your underwear are your pants found that very interesting. Um, yeah. Oh. Oh, and I don't have a skin. I had a nice little, uh, like, a flask or skin type thing. Um, I need to make a javelin, because I need a hunt. Okay. I do want to zoom, actually, let's go ahead and hit F6. See where I am? I'm in the middle. Let's check my culture. Right in the middle of some culture tribe. Some a culture area. So there may be some villages around me. That would be nice. I don't think these guys have any um or have any shops. Fortunately. They are dominantly based in their build. Um. Yeah, they don't have any shops, but there are plenty of reindeer herds from which you can buy an animal, and you can trade with local hunters for hunting and trapping gear. That's nice. That is very nice. It'd be nice to find a village over here. Um, go ahead and escape. Okay. I'm not going to use that firewood quite yet. Okay, let's see if I can pick that up. Good. Actually... Yeah, you can still see I'm very new to this game. Actually, ooh, I don't remember what the button is. Do remember what the button for help is, though. A. Okay. Escape. Um. Shift A. Ooh, um. Warmth. Wow, I have strong protection. 
or superior protection um, in my main body. I just need some arms and a little uh, and a hat. I like hats. Um, survival is OD. Yes. Yeah, you can definitely tell I uh, played a little bit before. Um, I do have a new mic. Forgot to mention that. I got a new headset, like I said at the beginning. That it, It's very nice and extremely comfortable compared to my old one. It's a Creative Tactic 3D. Um, Sigma. Okay, E. Cancel. So, Alt E to build a fire. Okay, um, I think it's carpentry. Curious, what do I need for an arrow? I need a branch, a knife, tying equipment, and a rock. Hmm, tying equipment. I think like a rope or some or a cord or something. Um. Tree, paddle, wooden shovel, giant flail, an arrow, a short bow, ski stick, skis. What's a short bow? A board. Oh, that's a um, yeah. An axe. Which I do have a hand axe. I do have a hand axe, knife, and tying equipment. I will want to eventually get a bow because I personally like bows. Stretch there. Um, shift S. Building. A cota. A fence. A cellar. Deconstruct something. I guess I could deconstruct this. Um, shift S. Is it timbercraft? Fell a tree. Chop a fell tree into blocks. Split firewood from a block. Carve a trunk into logs, split a trunk into boards, peel bark from a tree. No. Don't know how to make weapons. No, I have to make it. I think it's E. Maybe it's survival. Eat something. Ulti. Make a hole in the ice. Hmm. You can tell I'm still very, very new at this. I'd work in foraging. No. Carpentry. Still think it's carpentry. it though physician my physician's rather low cookery is pretty low too rituals quite high um survival timber craft fishing is extremely high have some skiing. Yeah, that's right, I increased my spear. Tracking, hide working, foraging, carpentry. God damn it. Hmm. What? I will bring you people back when I know what. Okay, I found the menu via the internet. Okay. Building clothes, lumber, trapping. 
utility articles, weapons. Um, which we know, that's all. Um, lumber, staff. I want to make one, slender tree trunk. Okay, made myself a staff. They didn't take very long. Um, make weapons, javelin. To make one. So I only have one staff. Okay. I think my hand axes definitely helps with my time. Yeah, wow, well, that went really quick. Um. Got myself a javelin. I am a little hungry. Um, F, build a tree, yes, five slender tree trunks, I'm gonna pick up three. No movement, damn it. Inventory. Drop. One. Slender tree trunk. Still cannot move. And drop another one. Um. Oh, it's... Back up. Um, go into my inventory. Actually, no, not my inventory. No. Make lumber. Make myself a staff. Make myself one staff. Okay. How much does a staff weigh? Staff only weighs four pounds. I'd like to have four javelins, just because, um, no, make, lumber, staff, one, slender tree trunk, okay, I have two staffs, okay, Nope, I do not need any more. I'm gonna make one. Okay, slender trunk. Okay, um, thankfully I do have some food. Less than what I had last time. And no water nearby. So I'm gonna have to... Definitely watch my eating habits. Okay. Hold D. Build a fire. There. Fire there. Okay. Built me a fire. Um. Make. Weapons, javelin, three, three staffs, okay, I 
It's still gonna take me less than an hour or else there'd be double. That's pretty good. Yeah, 50 minutes to make three javelins. That's really good. Um. I do think it's that hand axe I have that makes it so quick for me. Um. Go and step back now. Um. D. Build a fire. There. Ritual. Oh wow, I know two rituals. I know the Oath of Iron and the Blood Staunching Prayer. That's nice. Let's go ahead and do that one. Tulen suuta sulkemaan panun päätä painamaan viskoa vilua vettä paikoille pallaan ehille tule tuki poltamille panun ehkipastamille. You make an oath with your iron weapon so that you will so that it will stay loyal to you and fight well in your hand. Okay. Um hopefully that's not that loud in the video, because I really can't um control the how loud stuff is. It's all D. Okay. All D. Iron. Tulen suutta sulkemaan panun päätä painamaan viskoa vilua vettä paikoille pallaan ehille tulen tuki poltamille panun ehkipastamille. It's, it's, it's just kind of funny. I think. Oh, the iron. I'm getting kind of hungry. Two enchanted javelins. Tulen suutta sulkemaan panun päätä painamaan viskoa vilua vettä paikoille pallaan ehille tulen tuki poltamille panun ehkipastamille.